Have you ever thought about how significant company culture is and how the style of leadership can shape it? Well, it is a fact that the culture within a company directly influences productivity, employee satisfaction, and talent retention. It's like the invisible hand that guides the organization's heartbeat. A positive culture is like a magnet, drawing in top-tier talent, fostering a sense of purpose, collaboration, and satisfaction among those within its fold. Key elements of a positive culture? Let's see, we have effective communication, inclusiveness, collaboration, and recognition of achievements. But like a ship navigating through the vast ocean, it needs a captain. Leadership, my friends, is that captain. It shapes the values, behaviors, and overall atmosphere within an organization. Leaders who prioritize transparency, authenticity, and engagement with their teams contribute to a culture of trust and shared purpose. So, you see, the journey to a great company culture is intertwined with the journey of its leadership. Now let's delve into some real-life examples of how leadership styles can impact company culture. Consider the contrasting leadership styles of Satya Nadella at Microsoft and Elizabeth Holmes at Theranos. On one hand, Nadella, the tech titan at the helm of Microsoft, has prioritized transparency, authenticity, and engagement with his teams. His approach has fostered a culture of trust and shared purpose, with an emphasis on collaboration and open communication. This has not only bolstered employee satisfaction and productivity, but it's also attracted top-tier talent to the company. On the flip side, we have Elizabeth Holmes, the former CEO of the now-defunct biotech company Theranos. Her leadership was markedly different. Holmes's lack of transparency and accountability led to a company culture characterized by secrecy and mistrust. This approach ultimately proved detrimental, not only to the company's reputation, but also to its bottom line. The stark difference between these two leaders underscores the significant impact leadership can have on company culture. It's a clear demonstration of how the values and behaviors endorsed by those at the top can permeate an entire organization, influencing everything from employee morale to company performance. Now we'd love to hear your thoughts. How do you think leadership styles influence company culture? Have you experienced the effects of good or bad leadership firsthand? Give us a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you never miss a discussion. Can you see how these different approaches to leadership shape the cultures at Microsoft and Theranos? Share your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to subscribe. Today we're going to delve into the 10 pivotal steps of building and sustaining company culture, as outlined in our recent post. Step 1. Identify your company's vision and mission. These are the guiding principles of your organization. Step 2. Engage your team in defining your core values. These become your cultural pillar. Step 3. Practice transparency and mutual respect, creating an open and honest environment. Step 4. Encourage open communication. It is vital for problem-solving and innovation. Step 5. Foster inclusiveness where everyone is respected, valued, and heard. Step 6. Emphasize collaboration. Teamwork often brings about the best results. Step 7. Reinforce your culture regularly to ensure it remains vibrant and relevant. Step 8. Recognize and reward employees who exemplify your culture. It will inspire others to do the same. Step 9. Instill a growth mindset. Culture is dynamic and should evolve with your team. And finally, Step 10. Continuously collect feedback and make necessary adjustments to keep improving your culture. These steps underscore the importance of effective communication, inclusiveness, and collaboration in building a thriving company culture. Remember, it's a team effort and every contribution matters. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more insightful content. Thank you for joining us today.